In this video we will see what happens when we travel at the speed of light. That means approximately 300 million meters per second. And we can understand this by a really famous paradox known as the twin paradox. In 1905, great physicist Albert Einstein proposed the special theory of relativity. The theory had some really bold and fundamental postulates and one of them was that the speed of light is constant in every inertial frame. And due to this postulate, there are two very important consequences, that is the time dilation and length contraction. So Einstein's equations simply shows us that the faster you move with respect to someone, the slower the time flows for you. And we can really understand it by using twin paradox. So let us consider two twin brothers A and B and both have the age of 30. Now they decided to study time dilation and the brother A goes into a spaceship at the speed of root 3 by 2 c and he continuously travels for 10 years. This 10 years time is measured by A himself and B remains on earth waiting for his brother. So when A returns, his age is 30 plus 10 that is equal to 40 years. But for B, if we use the time dilation formula, 20 years have passed. So the age of B is 30 plus 20 that is equal to 50 years. So B is 10 years older than A and this is called the twin paradox. This effect is only due to the fact that speed of light is constant in every inertial frame. Now A travelled at the speed of root 3 by 2 c. What if he travels at the speed of c that is equal to the speed of light? If we use the time dilation and length contraction equations, we find out that at the speed of light, the length becomes Zero. That means there is no distance between two points in space and time become infinite with respect to some other observer who is at rest. So length becomes negligible and time becomes infinite. That means the clock will freeze. The person will no longer experience time. So this is what happens at the speed of light. Thanks for watching this video and subscribe this channel to support.